Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. Today you join me in Dingle. So following on from my last episode, I'm on my weekend away to this most beautiful part of photography in Ireland. And what I've decided to do is to climb up a ridge actually that's on Clotter Head. I've drove past this a number of times. And today I said, you know what? Feeling a small bit energetic, I'd actually come up here to see what the views were like. And I haven't been disappointed. I've got 360 degrees of views here. I can see the three sisters that are behind you. I've got Keown Chevelle or Sybil Head behind that. I've got Clotter Head right here, looking out onto on Far Marov. I've got on Tirucht, I've got the Blaskets, and I've got Dunmore Head as well behind me. So views for days basically here. Now, the evening is probably going to be an interesting one. There's a lot of high cloud that's there, but there's high cloud as well on the western horizon. So it's potentially going to block out the most important part of the light. But I'm hoping that the high clouds that are surrounding me will actually catch some of the light as well at sunset. I think it's going to be a very interesting uh, shoot this evening. Hopefully I get some nice shots. What I'm going to do now is wait for the sun to start dipping and wait to see if I can get some of that gorgeous golden light. And if it hits some of those peaks that are around me as well here, I think I'm in for a treat. So that's what we're going to do today. Let's go. Let's see how we get on. I think I got some lovely drone footage actually from up here. It was great to be able to have this height and I got a couple of shots of me actually behind with the islands that are around me as well. And the sun now is starting to hit golden hour and uh, there is a lot of clouds actually on the horizon. They may actually catch, I never know, you never know, I might get lucky, but I am still hopeful for behind me here with the high clouds that are there that they'll catch over Sybil Head and the Three Sisters. It's going to be an interesting one as well because on the side of the Blaskets now as well I'm getting a nice bit of light. So I've changed out now and I'm on my long lens, my 70-200 as you can see here. And I also have my filter which is my 0.9 ND grad. And that's just to be able to control the brightness that I have of the sun that's directly in front of me. I think I'm going to get a couple of shots. I'm going to take a photograph of the different headlands that are around here. So Dunmore Head, I'm going to get a shot of the Blaskets. Don Tirucht, uh, on Far Marov, and then the Three Sisters, and behind me as well is Monk Brandon. But yeah, waiting now just for this light. It's starting to come anyway, but I think I'm going to get some nice shots here this evening. Regardless, this is a great viewpoint actually. And I'm surprised I never come up here after all this time I've come here, but today now is the day that I decided to come up here, and I'm glad that I did.
I might actually be in luck. As you can see here, I'm getting a nice bit of light now shining on me as the sun is setting here. And it's setting over Clotter Head. It's lighting up all of the headlands actually around me. I'm getting some lovely light as well over on Dunmore Head. And behind me here now as well is what I'm really hopeful for is that really kicks off above the three sisters behind here. If that happens, I think I'm in for some gorgeous images as the light now as well is coming it's hitting off these rocks that i'm on on top of me here and i'm using those as a foreground interest swap back now to my uh, 16 to 35 and that allows me to be able to get something on the ground level and then keeping the uh, light as well that's there close enough now to the horizon i think i'm going to get lucky this evening hopefully i don't jinx myself but yeah it's going to kick off i think so i hope so and i really 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 really, really think it might Look at that, the sun has just gone down there now and we've got a lot of high clouds that hopefully will be catching and go some crimson red as well to reward me for my evening here for photography on the Dingle Peninsula. I think I got some lovely shots as the light would have actually changed as well and now with the sun behind me as you can barely see me I'm in silhouette, it's getting quite cold, I have my gloves on me just to make sure that my hands don't get too cold from standing up here, it's quite windy as well the whole time but yeah what a beautiful evening here in Dingle. I'm delighted I made this hike up to here because I've had full 360 views of some incredible bits of landscape as well to take some photographs of. I'm gonna finish up this episode now, yet I'm gonna hang on and see if I do get that afterglow in relation to the light. Thank you very, very much as always for joining me. I hope you enjoyed this episode as much as I did actually being here. If it's the first time on the channel, please hit the subscribe button, give me a like, give me a comment, and until the next time, schlange voll.